have very naive immune systems, so which means that they're highly susceptible to diseases. Um, so it's really important that you properly disinfect and clean all the feeding equipment, which includes bottles, pails, nipples, and anything you use to feed milk with. This will help reduce the risk of bacterial contamination and decrease the risk of disease for your calves. wash our feeding equipment here at the GAC. Laura is going to demonstrate what we do while I explain the steps. Um, the first step is to obviously take the nipple off of the bottle and then we rinse the bottle with lukewarm water. It's important the first step is lukewarm water as the hot water will coagulate the milk protein and it will cause an adherence to the bottle and there will be an increased risk of bacterial contamination. the bottle with lukewarm water you're going to want to use a detergent and hot water at around 50 degrees celsius uh, the water is going to be too hot to touch but should be comfortable while wearing gloves and then following adding the detergent and water you're going to scrub it with a brush and here's our brush or here we use a 10% bleach solution and a little bit of water and we rinse the bottle out. And after we've done that, we leave the bottle to dry on a drying rack. All right, so what we showed you was how we clean and disinfect our bottles, but we do that same procedure for all feeding equipment that we use here at the PY agency. So whisks, pails, and our milk machine, we use an acid detergent to clean about everything. So that's it for this week's video on cleaning feeding equipment. Catch you guys next week, bye! bye.